Okay, we're back for part five of um, making ephemera for the Cracker Box journal. It sounds like it's raining outside. Okay, let me... Cut this one down a little bit more. Okay, maybe a little bit more on this end too. Okay, let's get our journal. So this is the front. And the way this is facing. See, we're going to glue this like right here. On at least two sides. That way they can tuck things in between there. So let us get to gluing. And you might want to, let me see if I can get to my wax paper. Put some wax paper underneath, just in case some of this glue seeps off the edges there. See, like it just did right here off the top. It squirted out the top. So if you use wax paper, because it's wax paper, it won't get all over everything. So now... Let's see here. And I didn't make three of those, so I'm only going to, let's put this in the middle. We're going to fold it on this fold. And we're going to glue this right here. That way you can tuck things underneath there. Let me find some more wax paper.
Okay, we'll put that like this. All right, let's go back here to the third signature. And we will put this one right here. in there. All right, next. This we can use. I was thinking I was going to put a piece of clear plastic. Let's see here. So they can use this as a, you know, they can, as a pocket. So let me see if I can find. Hmm, something just hit that window. I don't know what it was, but let me see if I can find a piece of plastic for that. Where would it be? I know I kept some, but what did I do with it? I really thought I put it in a cigar box. Let's see if I put it in this cigar box. I did. See, I got this. Just thinking if we um. And then we just cut around it. We can stick it in there. Okay, okay, okay. So we're gonna go Hopefully I can trim this without boogering up the edges of the thingy. Look, it's sticking to me. It's sticking to me. Okay. Okay. Am 
have thought he'd go outside, escape, while hubby took the neighbor on wherever he needed to go to. So it's raining outside and Emma's stuck probably out in the yard, not liking it very much. I don't know what we're going to do at the new house. But we'll have a garage there, so... Unless we go in through the front door, they're not going to get out. Because we'll go in through the garage. Okay, so now we can glue three sides and this can be a pocket. Right here, we're gonna go right here. down in there. Get that all the way down there. Alright, we're going to add some pockets, I think, to the front right here. And I still have some of the original Do I want to make it a little bit bigger than that? I think I do. Hmm. 
Uh, I have to talk with hubby for a second. Okay. I'll make this the bottom. I find that it's easier to get things out of these pockets if you make this little lip like this. Okay, then next, we need to make our little tabby thing right there. I'm looking for my hole punch. Yeah, I just got it on me. I just got it on me. Might need to get some clips for this. Okay. Let's put this. There's either a cat in here or there's a ghost in here. I don't know which it, which it is. And see this way with the, those little hinges on the side, you got a little room. They can get things in and out of that pocket. We'll put that right there. Then, We want to put one in the back. I don't want that color though. All right, let's see what else we have over here. Oh, we've got these belly bands. Oh, we've got these little corners too. Like I've seen in here somewhere. I 
We'll see, we can make this a pocket too. Where'd that little corner go? See, we could make a little corner. Just decor, just um, to decorate the page a little bit. Or we could just do two sides and make it a little um, place to tuck something. Like a little piece of paper. Like this. But we could also make these belly bands. like this and then you just take these and you tuck them underneath like that so let's see here let me go find a different color to do another pocket on the back side And then we need to do a couple of like folded paper places to journal. So let me find a scrap piece of paper so we can do the back pocket. I'll be back in a second. I found this gold with pink. What do you think? Do you think that would work on the back? Where's my pencil? Pencil, pencil. I've lost it. Okay. There. My desk is turning into a mess. <clears throat> it's a mess. Well, I did that one totally wrong. Okay. And what I meant was I needed it to be wider than the marks because of the fold I'm going to do on it. But that's, that's me. Never thinking. Okay. Okay. 
And of course my folds aren't straight. That's okay. That's okay. You get what you get. Okay, now let's cut. going to glue this one back here. But I think I'm also going to use this paper and cut out I know what I want to do. It's hard to explain. Okay. And then do we want to decorate the front of this journal? Or should we let the person decorate their own? We'll just put some things in there. Okay, let me get out the die cut machine because we're going to... I need a backing for this. So I need number one to find. Okay. Die cuts are falling everywhere. There goes my glue again. I need to clean my desk off. I guess that's what it's telling me.
I think we're done. Okay, so what I want to do, why I did that, is I want to glue these on top. And then that will make this easier to glue into our journal. But I gotta get my glue. Makes it hard if you're shaky. I got it as straight as I could. I'm not going to try and correct it too much because I don't correct very well. So there's that one. Guess I should be having some glue paper underneath all of this. All right, there's two. And then we're gonna put this one right there. I really think there's four of these, but I only had three, I think, to start with. Uh, you can tell I didn't get very straight on the edges on this one when I cut it. And see, then we'll stick this on the page and we'll glue the top and bottom and you can slide things this way. So let us see where we want to put these. Right there might be a good spot. like that. OK. 
Okay. find another piece of wax paper. Oh, banana does not taste good four days later. See what else we've got over here. Do I have any more big pieces of plastic left? use this one. I do with it. We will let this kind of dry before we put it in our book. Okay, let's see. Scrap papers. We've got our tags in our corner. We'll put these in in a minute. Let me think about what I want to do with these. just to put these as a corner. Like a corner tuck on certain pages. Like let's do these brown pages, shall we? And let's use the double-sided tape and hope that it doesn't tear.
don't want the stickiness to stay on that page. You know what I'm saying? Anybody have a suggestion on how to get this excess glue off of here? I don't want nothing. You Maybe I'll just go with the dot method. sticky. And then I've got two left, so let's do on the back side. There's a little piece here that needed to pop out. Yeah, it tore, so we're going to leave it. We're going to leave it. Put it on the first one and we'll go back here to the third one on the back page.
Okay, I need a piece of wax paper. I'll leave that one there. I'll leave that one there. That one there. That one should be good. Okay, let's let this stuff dry. Let me go get some ribbon and we will put some ribbon. But my thought was to take some of this paper and put it on the back with the lines. But they can just write on it as is. So let's find the ribbon, shall we? We're going to use yarn. I can put some charms on here too. Charms on the tags. Oops, sorry, we bumped you. I bumped you. Okay, let's do this. Let's work on these tags. A few of them anyway. And I think tomorrow we can finish this up.
there's all kinds of things you can do in a journal. You can do flips, folds, um, altered paper clips, pockets, secret hiding spots. Maybe we'll do a secret hiding spot, but not put it in, actually in, or paste it to a page. Okay, I need three more. Okay, so tomorrow we will finish it up and do a few other things and that journal will be ready for the Easter egg giveaway at my daughter's house. So that's going to do it for today's video. As always, be safe. Don't let the world change your smile. Let your smile change the world. Until next time, bye.